So, hey guys, welcome to Comic Game. If you're new, make sure you hit the subscribe button and the little bell. Comment below, hit the like button, and maybe even share with your friends. Good job. We have cookies. And milk. Might be semen, I'm not sure. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Hey guys, welcome back to Comageddon. This is John Wise with your tour review. This week's tour review is from the Kenner Super Power line that was uh, out in, back in the early 80s. Uh, they had various different DC characters such as Superman, Batman, Robin, villains like Darkseid, Brainiac, and of course Lex Luthor. Uh, the cool thing about these is they each came with like a mini comic um, that you can read about their stories. And, you know, the action of why, you know, they're fighting in this particular superpowers line. Each one also featured a special action feature, which I'll go over here shortly. First off, let's go ahead and go over Lex Luthor's scope and body. Okay, so here we have Lex Luthor looking, if you look closely, almost resembles Gene Hackman. I always thought that about this particular figure, which isn't bad. He's popular Lex, but he also resembles kind of the Legion of Doom Lex. A little bit of mix there. Uh, he has his green suit on, uh, painted very well here. Um, nice bright uh, pink belt with the uh, green tunic here, which is separate from his legs, so you can get some leg movement out of there later. Uh, we go to the back, and... Uh, Again, nice sculpt, paint job. We got a like, little uh, uh, turtleneck thing going on here. Um, this will be described shortly. And then again, that belt just continues to go around at the back. All the way down here, we got the green. And of course, his bright pink boots. Now, Lex's action feature, like many, uh, was basically, it's kind of like a karate chop kind of thing. Uh, or power running. He just squeeze his legs and do that. That's about all Lex does. However, Lex Luthor does come with one accessory, and that is the other part of his body suit, which clips on just over him, and it, when it clips on, it clips on to this little latch here, so you can easily remove it on and off, and it just literally goes over and snaps on like so. So now we have Lex Luthor wearing his body armor, and wanting to move and jive. Now, one thing I do have an issue with at times, because his legs do go in and out, the older the version, they don't, they tend to do loosey-doosey here. So, um, the articulation with this on is kind of hard to do, because this is on, I mean, his head... Without the armor, does move left to right. His arms will go up and down, but as you can see, his action feature, his arms are going to just kind of, yeah, springy. His legs do go forward and backwards, and he still dances. All right. So, there you go. Uh, you can find these superpower figures such as Lex Luthor uh, on sites like eBay. It's really the only spot you're going to be able to find them um, online. Uh, they do get pretty pricey, especially you know if you're looking for more of the popular figures like Superman, Batman. They tend to go for um, $50, $60 to $100 or more if they're on card. So, um, it's still pretty fun. Uh, nice childhood remembrance here. So, by all means, uh, if you're able to afford it, I highly suggest going ahead and starting up your Super Powers uh, Kenner Action Figure toy line. So, and that's all, Lex. Until next time.
And of course, if you like this video, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Make sure you hit the like, comment below, and share with your friends. <laughs> I hate you.